Showbiz Tonight's counting down the top five shocking celebrity rages. Here's where we are so far. At number five in our countdown, Chris Brown versus a window. Nothing like taking your frustrations out on a piece of glass. At number four, Alec Baldwin chooses his words with an airline attendant uncarefully and gets booted off a plane. Is uncarefully a word? Number three, Christian Bale, who takes out his rage on a member of his movie crew. And that brings us to number two on the showbiz countdown, shocking celebrity rages. Oh, how could we forget supermodel Naomi Campbell? She's a repeat rage offender. Let me take out the showbiz news line for Naomi. There is so much ground to cover with her. You remember back in 2000, she pled guilty to attacking her former assistant after allegedly hitting her on the head with a cell phone and threatening to throw her out of a moving car. In 2006, she pled guilty to assaulting her housekeeper with her Blackberry. It was 2007 when Naomi was sentenced to community service after she admitted to swearing, kicking, and spitting at police officers aboard a British Airways flight. In April of 2010, getting exhausted, Naomi totally lost her cool when an ABC News crew asked her about receiving so-called blood diamonds from former president of Liberia, Charles Taylor, who was convicted of aiding rebels who raped, killed, and mutilated civilians in neighboring Sierra Leone. Watch this. Received a diamond from Charles... I did receive a diamond, and I'm not going to speak about that. Thank you very much. And I'm not here for that. No, we're not answering these questions. Well, we've been told that you didn't help the prosecution sort of in this very important case. Sorry. Thank you so much. Sorry. Goodbye. Sorry. Let's get up. All right. Nice move, Naomi. Back with me now, Joey Fatone. He's the host of the brand new show, My Family Recipe Rocks on the Live Well Network. In Hollywood, entertainment journalist Jillian Reynolds. Now, Joey, she clearly has been a serial rager. You There's cannot deny here. You yeah. can't deny the evidence, but it has been, I must say, and I'm pleased to say, over two years since we've had another incident that we at least know of. Mm -hmm. Do you think she's possibly changed her ways? Um, I hope so. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I'm just looking at that video clip, you know, she was like, oh, thank you. And then she decided well, she to politely it raged yeah, yes she politely raged i mean she tried as, as much as she could but sometimes it, it is kind of hard when you have somebody constantly nagging you and then it just happens where you just snap yeah. but i think with there's a pattern with her there. well there's a self-control <laughs> thing you can you can get aggravated but it doesn't mean you have to act out Rage in a violent way jillian what do you think is it possible that she could have changed her stripes and, and maybe she's a, a calmer more zen like naomi Oh, of course. I mean, I, I don't know if you guys remember a few years back, she was with Tyra and Tyra Banks called her out and said, you were really brutal to me. You were mean to me. And, and Amy was like, I'm so sorry. Um, of course, people, we tend to think that it's like the intense actors that blow out. But I remember hearing um, Casey Kasem was doing like a rundown and he freaked out and Bill O'Reilly and Naomi Campbell, this all caught on tape. And you, for me, I love being a fly on the wall and seeing it. I don't necessarily think it's fun to be on the receiving end of it no. if they're throwing cell phones and things. But I think everyone can change. And, you know, especially something like that, that's heavy yeah. duty. That was like people's lives. There was Sierra Leone. I mean, that was like civil war. They were killing children. Mm -hmm. And that, that's a heavy duty subject. Um, and I think that, uh, you know, if if I if I didn't receive a diamond, I would have been very forthright and said, absolutely not. It was kind of weird the way that it was handled. It was a little strange. But that now brings us to number one on our showbiz countdown. Shocking celebrity rages. Got to give that honor to Mel Gibson because also a serial rager. Many meltdowns caught on tape. Back in 2010, Radar Online posted a series of downright explosive recordings of a man who sounded an awful lot like Mel saying the most horrific things to his ex-girlfriend, Oksana Gurigoryeva. Uh, yeah, it was actually pretty tough for us to choose which clip to play from the minutes upon minutes we had to choose from. Joey, do you think that Mel's image has ever recovered from that? Personally, I don't. I don't think it has, yeah. It, I don't think it has at all. I mean, just, just from the, the mishaps and so much things that have been recorded that he has done and said and you have seen, it's, it's, a, it's a tough thing to get out of because people always remember that. You know, people remember these kind of things, these slip-ups. And I think for him... It's just, it's going to be a hard thing to recover. You're a good guy. I know you to be a good guy. We've I try. We've kind of known each other for years. <laughs> but still, you're very conscious of the fact that when you're being recorded, have a microphone on, or you're on the phone, you're careful with 
what yeah, you Yeah, I mean, you, you just want to, you know, just get respect as much as you have from somebody else. I mean, even so, some people are going to piss you off or get really mad, and you just got to hone it down and just say, you know what? I'm not going to answer that. This is the deal. Yeah. You know, I mean, I might get mad right now. Well, I might start yelling and yeah, screaming. Don't do you that. You have to start putting my fist down getting mad. But I have to tell you. When you ask me these questions. We do have to give it up for Mel. I mean, even though he's number one in the countdown for something bad, it's good because he's at the top. Joey Patone, Jillian, I got to end it there. Thank you so much for being with us tonight.